Hey guys, it's X Lizandria X, and you know what type of content I like to make. I like to make vlogs, talking videos, TV show commentary, and movie commentary. And today we're gonna be doing a television commentary. Now you guys know I've been away from the commentary for some time now. I've just been busy trying to get myself together, get my life together. And, but also I haven't really been able to make a video because I work a lot now, because it's summertime. And you know, I don't typically get, glammed up for these videos but y'all haven't seen me glammed up some time so i'm like okay gotta get y'all i mean y'all haven't seen me glammed up y'all know i don't really care too much for glam and makeup anyways but you know y'all haven't seen it and sometimes i was like why not all right so today we're gonna be talking about stoked and basically the title of this video stoked basically 16 but at the beach um if you guys want me to talk about other te television commentaries, um, let me know two movies that I kind of want to do. I want to talk about two movies I want to do. Um, which one do you guys want? Let me know in the comments down below. Either Let It Shine or Jumping the Broom. They're both um, black movies, but one of them is a Disney Channel original and the other one is like an actual movie. Yeah. So let's just get on with today's video we're gonna talk about what is stoked okay stoked is about some teens who work at a resort for the summer but they mainly just want to surf um the show was also created by the creators of 16 and total drama jennifer perch and tom mcgillis it was created in like 2009 or 2010 can't really remember which one but it's one of the two so yeah it's basically just some kids they for summer vacation they're working at a resort um and they just basically wanted to surf now let's get into the caricatures okay, we got reef the try hard hottie who wants to hit on chicks and he's really lazy y you guys will get to see the pattern if you've seen my 16 commentary i think you'll understand the pattern of who these characters relate to but let's keep going finn she surfs and has this low-key crush on reef she's kind of mean but not at the same time Lo, daughter of the man, uh, Mr. Ridgemount, who owns the hotel, and she has to work at the hotel because she threw a party in the beginning of the beginning of the series, and she's just basically the spoiled rich girl. Brosif basically just wants to surf, and he's just a chill dude. Emma is just learning how to surf, and she's just happy and free spirited. Then we have Johnny, huge crush on Emma, and he works at the front desk um you guys see the resemblance to these characters i'm gonna get into if you watch stoked then you see the similarities it has to 16 character wise reef is jonesy finn is nikki lo is caitlin broseph is jude emma is jen and johnny is wyatt basically they hang out at the beach and they basically hang out at the beach while in 16 they hang out at the mall and have jobs you see like a lot of the similarities like it's basically like i said stoked is basically just 16 but at the beach now i'm going to get into the side characters that is in the show quite often but they're not a part of the main cast so uh we have mr bomber or bummer that's the hotel manager and he's just a jerk Honestly, he's just a stereotypical manager. Then we have Kahuna. It's just, it just feels like he's just there to live at the beach and smoke weed. We know he's smoking weed. Like, even though it is like a television show for children, so they don't imply that, we know he's at the beach smoking some weed because that man is always as high as a kite. So I'm going to talk about uh, Finn and Reef's rivalry. Basic, they basically had a rivalry to prove that they didn't like each other. Um, and basically they hated each other, but they liked each other. Like they, I think what the show was trying to go for at first was this enemies to love or friendship, but I'm not, I don't think I want to spoil it, but many of you guys have not seen Stoked. Stoked is a really good show, but um, I'm just going to go on and say spoiler alerts. So skip ahead if you don't want to hear the spoiler alert but um basically i think they were trying to create this enemies to lovers relationship with finn and um reef but in actuality reef ended up getting with 
like um, Lo. And then at the end of season two, Lo is now has this crush on either Johnny or Bro Sip. I can't really remember, but it's one of the guys. Obviously, it's not Reef, but there's a new relationship getting sparked. So now I want to talk about Johnny and his crush on Emma. Look. Johnny was down bad for Emma. Okay, he was a simp. Like I just couldn't I just couldn't stand to watch Johnny just be this huge simp for Emma and Emma did not like him because Emma was a simp for Ty, Lowe's older brother. Like she had a crush on um Lowe's older brother, so she was so oblivious. Like I think also her character, Emma, was just an oblivious character at times. She was just so obliv oblivious to um, Johnny liking her because she liked Ty so much and anything that Johnny did, she just thought it was super sweet and he was just being a good friend. When in actuality, Johnny just had this huge crush. Like he, I was like, bro, she does not like you. Like I was not understanding why he simped so bad in knowing good and well that Emma did not have the same feelings for him. It was just stupid to me. Like I just, mm, I didn't, I didn't understand it. But um, so yeah, that's basically my whole thing with um, Johnny and his simpness for. Um, I feel like he's definitely equivalent to Mordecai from regular show. Him and Mordecai were down bad. Mordecai was down bad for Margaret and um, so Johnny was definitely down bad for Emma. But yeah, my final thoughts on the show. Like I said, it was a really good show, really chill, laid back show. It was very equivalent to 16. Like I said, if you, if you like 16, you will definitely like Stoked because it, they're basically a lot of the same shows they use a lot of the same music from total drama so you definitely know it's a show created by jennifer perch and tom mcgillis but other than that thank you guys so much for watching this video like comment share and save if you would like and i hope that you have a good day bye